if your outlet is not working so this is the solution right here um, very simple tool five dollars all you need basically to troubleshoot an outlet so in this condition right here right now you can see it has indicators right there uh, when two lights are on that means it's correct so I had very shortly um, when I fixed this problem, I'm going to show you the video. One of my outlets in the bedroom had a disconnected wire, which was open neutral. It was showing open neutral. In many people's case, that's the case, open neutral or open hot. So these old outlets in older homes don't have these uh, side pins where uh, it could be just bolt mounted uh, wiring. They just push it in into the, these uh, holes and it becomes loose. So look at the video that I'm touching right here and you can see neutral wire basically burnt out and it just came out of the uh, outlet and it wasn't it was basically not letting power go through the less rest of the outlets. So four, two outlets were working, three were not working. So how are you going to troubleshoot two outlets working on one wall? Let's say you have one outlet on one wall, you have two. Just common sense just go to the nearest outlet and plug it in and if it's working you're gonna basically uh, pull out one working one non-working outlet and inspect for this type of disconnection or you're gonna inspect for wire nuts because there are um, pigtails in the box inside of the outlet where basically it uh, three wires connected together through the wire nut and only one wire coming in to feed the outlet. So it could be loose wiring inside of the wire nut or it could be wire nutted like this. So basically a line comes in and goes out from the bottom, goes to another outlet and so on and on and on. So you're gonna inspect. So let's say uh, one outlet could be working just fine because it's getting power but it's not getting power basically getting not not getting out of this outlet and not feeding the next outlet in the chain so that's what you're gonna look for very very simple make sure you do not work on live circuits make sure you do turn off your um, breakers for the outlets and also this sticky tool before you touch any wire it must have tool as well so you just know that you're not touching hot life wires when you are working on them so these two tools could be like 15 bucks or so um, and yeah that's the video thanks for watching see you in the next one